Chuck, come here. Get in here, close, 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 close. Too close, back up a little bit. Good, good. Are the liberals gone? <laughs> Quick test, when they go low, perfect, we're alone. <laughs> it's time for Just Between Us. <laughs> just between us, gun rights are stronger than ever. In fact, that same panel that's advocating stronger background checks is also about to pass a breakthrough pro-gun measure this week. Look at this. In a major victory for gun rights advocates, the House committee advanced the Republican Concealed Carry Reciprocity Act. Backed by the NRA, it would allow gun owners to carry their concealed weapons across state lines with a permit. Our rights should not end where a state line ends. This is about the, the equal access of your pro-choice right of self-defense. Yes, yeah, suck it, snowflakes. <laughs> Pro-choice is our thing now. <laughs> Next, we're coming for their electric cars. We're gonna make them run on elephant blood. <laughs> Let's break this down. What is gun reciprocity? First off, don't worry. I know reciprocity sounds like some YA novel about high schoolers with awesome powers, <laughs> and that's because it is, I wrote it. <laughs> but the reciprocity I'm talking about is way cooler. Gun reciprocity means that if you're allowed to carry a gun in your state, you're allowed to do it in any other state. And 12 states don't have any restrictions beyond the minimum federal requirements. Live in those states? It's, it's awesome. Any day could turn into a Die Hard movie. <laughs> Wyoming is like 85% Bruce Willis's. <laughs> this new bill is beautiful because it lowers the bar across the country so that every state has to abide by the loosest concealed carry laws. Americans love lowering the bar. It's so much easier to get over it that way. <laughs> now, to get specific, let's look at the laws in a state like Georgia. Say you're a convicted domestic abuser who lives there. You have a conceal and carry permit because Georgia allows you to, despite your abuse conviction. Then you come to a liberal hellhole like New York that doesn't <laughs> allow domestic abusers to carry guns. I know, crazy. <laughs> Under the reciprocity bill, you'd still be allowed to carry that gun. All right. I know what you're thinking. Jordan, a domestic abuser is not a good guy with a gun. Yes, well, of course. In Georgia, he's not. But in New York, maybe he would be. <laughs> it's like Sinatra said, if you can make it here with a gun, you can make it anywhere with a gun. <laughs> Reciprocity is like if all the gunslingers in HBO's Westworld started showing up in other shows with their guns. <laughs> America just put more bang in the Big Bang Theory. <laughs> and just between us, it gets even better because America is still gunny as f <laughs> And it's not just the adults. Wisconsin's new law that allows hunters of any age to carry a weapon has already led to licenses being sold to infants. 10 mentored hunting licenses were sold over the last two weeks, all to children under the age of one. <laughs> the terrible twos just got real. <laughs> It, it is great that this passed in Wisconsin, but you know what's even greater? Wisconsin became the 35th state with no minimum hunting age. They may not be able to stand their ground yet, but they can definitely do tummy time on their ground. <laughs> gun advocates are gun racking up wins all over, no matter what the libs are celebrating. I mean, just look at our president. You really think this guy will allow meaningful gun control? I have a license to carry in New York. Can you believe that? Nobody knows that. Bing, pew, pew, yeah, pew, oh, pew, whoo. You can tell Trump's a pro. <laughs> Rule number one, whenever you shoot, look dope as hell. <laughs> now, remember, this whole thing is just between us. Don't let any of those pomegranate juicy and liberals hear about reciprocity, and especially don't let them call this one number, which will connect them to the representative so they can weigh in on the National Carry Reciprocity Act. Yes. It's happening this week. Oh, yeah, and definitely do not take a picture of this and definitely do not post it on social media. Yeah, if they get their hands on this, these liberals are going to grab onto these dangerous opinions, conceal and carry them, and then whip them out when we least expect it.